What's up, y'all? My name is Queen Ezzy, and these are my Sims. Welcome back to another episode of um, the Every Aspiration Challenge. And uh, what we're going to do today is we're going to age up Devin because she has completed her teen aspiration and she is ready, ready to age up. So, first everybody's gonna eat dinner or everybody that's hungry is going to eat dinner um my guy Devin he has been working on a project I don't know it must be something glitch with this because he's clearly finished working on this I don't know why it does this like now so I'm gonna I'm gonna have him put this in his inventory and throw this away okay well don't put it in your inventory oh he's still working on it stop working on it stop it stop it it's over with okay throw this away and then put this in your inventory and yeah and then you can go get something to eat what's going on out here with the door i'm sick of random ass people showing up here we don't know you get the hell off our porch Okay, yeah, then go get you something to eat. Where's Dream? Okay, so this after, okay, good, she's she's finished. So I'm gonna have her, who put this plate down here and then didn't eat it? Where is uh Kobe? Kobe, don't even go get you nothing else to eat. Just eat this, cause somebody put a plate down and didn't eat it. All right, so she going to get her some food. Girl, no. <laughs> We need you to make a, uh, oh no we don't. It's one in the refrigerator. How about that? So we're going to pull that birthday cake out. And Devin is like asleep anyway. <laughs> Devin had a long day, okay? She's tired. But we're going to put this honey cake out for her. Uh. Uh. Maybe not. How come we can't pick the cake up? Oh, okay. Place it world. Let me let her place it in world. Maybe she'll place it somewhere where we can do something with it. Maybe. Hopefully. Let's see. Where's she gonna put it? Of course. Of course. Of course. She gonna go. Where are you going with it? Oh, oh. Are you? No, no. She's gonna put it on the table. You know that you can't blow out candles on the table. That's okay though, cause you putting it out like that means that we can move it right over there. Okay, Devin, it is birthday time, girl. Look at her, she exhausted. Get up, girl, it's time for you to blow out your candles and become a grown woman. What the? <laughs> Did I catch you like what? What is this position? Wait. What? What, <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Wait. Did I did I catch you at the wrong time, Devin? Like, what is this exactly? Like, what are you doing? I paused it right as you were waking up from your nap. That's crazy hilarious hilarious that is very hilarious look at that <laughs> okay girl get up let's let's put a uh let's put some actions on here let's form a group everybody in the household except for the little baby of course and um let me go downstairs where everybody is already i know you're not eating seconds dream you're not even who put that there somebody put that there i hate when they do that they just they just take a piece of um they just take a plate <laughs> set it down and walk away like what are you doing eat if you're gonna eat eat but i know she didn't put this here so i'm gonna put hers back in the refrigerator well, I was going to put it back in the refrigerator. Okay, girl, where you at? Come on, so you can blow these candles out. We actually need everybody to go here so they can see you blow these candles out. And age up into a young lady. All 
Are y'all gonna cheer? I was finna say if y'all don't cheer. <laughs> All right, she aged up. She got self-absorbed. She loves the outdoors. What's her third trait gonna be? Hmm. <laughs> we don't even know what. I don't even know what she's gonna like aspire to be. Oh, you know what? What if we gave her? <laughs> I'm gonna give her the snob trait. And she wants to be a world famous um celebrity. We're gonna go with world famous celebrity. Ooh, she graduated Bella Victorian. Congratulations. Devin outshone. Okay. The whole school and graduated as Bella Victorian. Way to go. She's sure to have a leg up in the working world. The world is her oyster. Okay. Yes. Diploma uh, will arrive in the mail. Once you retrieve it, the diploma will be added to the household inventory, framed and ready to display proudly. Oh, so that other, uh, the, the other one we have, that must be um, Devin's high school diploma. Can we, why well, don't want to, like i'm gonna put the birthday candles back on here why won't he let us like um why won't he let them put that in their in their individual inventory so they can take it with them like she's not gonna be living here okay girl put away this cake because this is getting on my nerves it said this she don't own this item so so we can't put it away oh if we Oh, if you finna be on this bullshit, then we gonna eat this cake. Hold on. My dear, we gonna, we can't put it back in the refrigerator that we just took it out of. Yeah, we, we gonna eat this cake. Take these candles off, dear, and we gonna take a piece together. Something is up with the refrigerator. Oop, not put in inventory. And he put it in his inventory. Is he gonna, what are you gonna do with that? I want you to put it away. Uh, yeah, put away. And then everybody come in here and get some cake. Damn, did the group disband? Oh, two people went to sleep. Ah, oh, y'all tired asses. <laughs> everybody tired. Where is Devin? Devin Devin went to sleep too. Reach milestone. Little baby in here just getting milestones on her own. Now I can't even have her play with the toys because Dream put the toys up. She make me sick. <laughs> now I gotta go up here and try to get the toys out the toy box and shit. All right, let's let me go ahead on and do this. So I'm gonna open it up. Click down her own hub, put the rattle here, cause I haven't even seen them. Um, I never seen her. Ah man, she can't do this on the play mat. Well, how can she do it then? How, how everybody in the house gone? Now nah, you don't get to go to bed. Somebody got feed this child. How everybody in the house gonna go to sleep and leave the child up hungry? That's crazy. Give your little niece some something to eat, bruh. Feed your little niece. Where are you? Hello? Okay, let's try this again. Oh, maybe because she was playing with toys. He couldn't, or yeah, maybe he couldn't do it because she was doing it. So, okay, let's bottle feed her, bruh. Yeah, give her some food. She hungry. Her parents just went to sleep with their dumb ass. Okay. And then we're going to take her upstairs and we're going to put her to bed too, even though she's not even sleepy. Look at that. Her knees a-okay. <laughs> what? What's that? It's a computer girl. Look at her little knees. She, she in the green. She about to use it on herself though in a minute but everything else cool but we're gonna put you back up in the crib with your parents so they can handle you <laughs> you feel me <laughs> so we won't have to deal with this just yet 
what okay wait a minute can the camera angles please get better thank you okay put her to sleep up here she probably not gonna go to sleep right away but we need her to be you know out the way let me go ahead and put this in a little trash can over here wait a minute Where the bottle? Oh my gosh. What's wrong with this thing? Okay, wait. Let me find somewhere to just place it until I can get the camera angle how I want it. There we go. All right, you put her to sleep. Okay. Now you can go to bed because you need to go to bed. She'll be fine. She feeling playful because she didn't play with some toys. Weeble wobble from playing on a play mat <laughs> okay girl oh we she's upset you better go nightlight or whatever <laughs> so while the household sleeps you guys we will rejoin you in the morning all right y'all we have the whole household up except for Except for Kobe, um, and everybody is wanting to dote on little Miss Christy, but Dream wins. She's like, look, I got this. Let me handle this because you about to take my baby away. <laughs> you about to take my baby away. She got the last milestone. And you know, um, Taylor is like, mom, can you stop being so dramatic? I'm not taking her away. <laughs> Just let me change her diaper one last time and give her a bath. Because she need a bath. Girl, can you go do something about yourself? Thank you very much. Not a free air tinkler. Watch out. Christy frequently pees during diaper changers. Infants with the free air tinkler quirk are more sensitive to the air temperature in the room during diaper changes, which results in them peeing frequently during them. Okay, so... I need you to go do something too because this is this is grandma dream and christy's moment okay so i'm gonna have you come down here and watch tv and dream you're going to go to the bathroom i did upgrade the shower combo in here because it was about time for an upgrade so we're gonna go here and give christy a bath because she needs one she is hella dirty filthy even and then she got another quirk too i think i oh, know she got a milestone she unlocked the the laugh milestone oh look at her look at her little baby she's so cute and look at dream and giving her a little bath um but yeah what's so funny christy started laughing for the first time the cutest of giggles will now escape her while playing with toys and interacting with other sims more playing and socializing will lead her to start babbling then she also had her first blowout milestone unfortunately he yuck it was bound to happen but christy had her first blowout hopefully the diaper will hold next time She's so adorable. Oh, first bath milestone. She's speaking span. Nothing's better than a clean, happy Christy after her first bath. All right, Granny. <clears throat> Use. Okay, well, before you do that, can you come down here and put her on the little play mat? Let's just do that. And then they are going to move out. We're going to say bye-bye. Damn, you can ask the, the the pets to lay down? Okay. We're going to say bye-bye to our firstborn. There's two firsts. Firstborn child, firstborn grandchild. And let them go off and, ha and have more kids together. <clears throat> What's wrong with you? <laughs> Aw, she's like, sis, I'm going to miss you so much. And she's like, well, you can always come visit us. It's not going to be a problem. Okay, Green, are you bringing the baby? I told you to bring her and put her down on this playmat. And I'm not playing with you. Like, these Sims, 
they be having a mind of their own and they got me messed up because i don't have time to play i'm not playing with y'all i'm not playing with you put her down where i told you to put her down it and i don't know what you about to do, go do but i'm gonna make you go watch tv just in case you was about to disrupt some stuff that was going on some happenings now dream pick her up thank you very much and take her downstairs like i told you to do in the first damn place now y'all gonna stop playing with me around here or y'all gonna find y'all selves out of the house <laughs> shoot all right now oh girl shut up <laughs> stop all right so let's do some tubby time real quick real quick like so we can get her little milestones as much milestones as possible before she move up out of here let's check her milestones and see what she got let's view them she has learned to reach so she learned to reach she got her first bath she got her first diaper blowout lifted head okay born at a hospital um she learned to laugh she learned to coo she got her first smile that's cute okay so she didn't have she didn't came a long way she still don't got the one that i want her to have though so once we're done with tummy time here then we'll have her get fed and then they're gonna move out because this house is too crowded like there's too many sims in here we won't have time to be dealing with this <laughs> and as much money look how much money they have so when they move, they're taking a hundred thousand. Like Dream is like, here, take the money. Cause what is she gonna do with it? I mean, she got bukus, and then she got more money coming in. Cause her royalty videos, from the videos that she producing, is like, oh, you gonna feed her? Those, um, yeah, he is. Those royalty payments are like damn near thirty thousand dollars that she getting. That is ridiculous. Okay, so go use the bathroom and then take a shower or a bath, whatever you want to do. And we got to get little mama fed and get her all fixed up. And then her family's going to move and it'll be go time with the twins. School starting an hour for him. We definitely need to work on getting his... So he spent an hour exercising. We're going to have to go to the gym and let him exercise some more. <clears throat> so we can get that milestone complete because we got we to gotta do that. And we got to age him up. Now, when I age him up here, he's going to look a little different as far as like his his uh, outfits and stuff. Because, well, he, he, I don't know. I might leave him like he is. I don't know. Because I was going to say... When he's an adult, he has all those babies and stuff. And I thought about doing it here, but I think it'd be a little too complicated to try to get that done here. So he is going to have four kids, though. So I, I have to get that, that situated. This is getting on my nerves now. Okay. Is he he gotta use the restroom, but he can do that. Um He can do that school. What time is it? It's seven fifty one, yeah. He ain't gonna be able to, to do nothing else. Oh, you know what? With her becoming a world famous celebrity, I did want her to go into acting. So maybe I'll have her move to Del Sol Valley. No, we're gonna see him by himself. So let's girl, let's get you a job because you moving out too. <laughs> You gonna become an actor, and because she graduated Valley Victorian, she'll probably start like I don't know level three or something. She'll have a higher level. You're gonna become an actress. Let's see where are we? Yep, actress level three. Um, okay, so we have to just this select an agency. Okay, let's see. Consider AI staffing. Our agents look forward to booking your unproductive time with work. Please enable notifications to stay informed on the latest job field opportunities. Benefits, improved automated reminders, maximize your time spent working. Everyday extras. Our team has put faces into every wide angle crowd. Shot this town has ever filmed. We'll find work. We'll find you work no matter how small. 
more auditions for commercials and daytime tv gigs this one was improved automated reminders maximize your time spent working um maybe we'll go with this agency girl and see if you got a gig like get you a gig because you definitely got to get a move on oh okay hold on let me see what her skills are first what you got skills in honey okay you got you got four comedy skills three video gaming singing dancing you got five piano skill points okay you got some pretty good skills all right so let's go back and let's see this let's check for this audition and see what we got okay making music uh music i'm sorry you have to have guitar skill for that i think she got some charisma skill fitness level comedy she definitely got that one it's another comedy one handiness guitar fitness she got fitness let's do the comedy one because she got she got comedy level four so we'll we'll have that for her but she's gonna move out so let's go ahead on and split from household and move we're gonna give her some money too and she's gonna go to del sol valley so she can become this great actress and live her dream life in the spotlight yes okay we're gonna give her a hundred thousand <laughs> transfer it over and i'll be back once we've moved her into her house all right we're here with um devin oh my gosh i can't think of which kid this was so we're here with devin she just got here in her pajamas unfortunately is this uh oh no it's not her and this is the horrible ea house start a home but i just kind of you know gave it a new roof and then just kind of slap some things together on the inside so i give you all a quick tour and then we'll go back to our main household and we'll move out the other family now i'm not going to give their house a makeover mainly because i mean their house is okay this one was atrocious so coming in here um you know it's there's the door straight to the backyard <laughs> but then to your immediate left here we have the dining table and she's a yellow kind of gal so her um, kitchen her whole kitchen is in yellow uh, really her whole house but it's really like beige beige ish is the color beige and yellow accent color is yellow and then her living room area is here where she has a nice couch, a nice TV, fireplace. Her bedroom is through this door here. It's nothing spectacular. Just gave it a new fresh coat of paint, you know, some new furniture in here because it was lacking. So there's her bed and her desk, you know, just simple pretty simple stuff and then through the door that was in this hallway over here is a bathroom i mean this floor plan i i don't know man <laughs> but yeah here we go so here's the bathroom of course these uh the shower combo that's growing together so is the tile and the flooring in here and then that toilet is from seasons um her countertop and, and sink here is from Dream Home Decorator and so is her mirror. So that's it. And we wish our little Devin the best of luck, girl. Go out there and make something of yourself. We know. Hold on. Where, she, where is she? There she is. Girl, go out there and make something of yourself. We know you're going to be just fine. So I will go back to the other house, you all, and move out taylor and family be right back okay we're back finally with the main household i went ahead on and moved taylor and shy and christy out off screen so they're in their new home in san sequoia living it up having the best time and i don't know why he's so sad but we're about to go to the gym with him because excuse me 
he needs to work on the last part of his aspiration so he can age up and move out as well so I'm gonna go ahead on travel to the gym with him he's heard about this new fitness spot that just opened up in Willow Creek a renovated building excuse me y'all I just ate lunch I'm so sorry <laughs> But um, yeah, he's heard about this new fitness spot that's opened up in Willow Creek, and he's gonna go check it out. He's gonna go check it out and see what we come up with. He stinks. Like, so first things first is when we get here, he's gonna take a shower. And I know it seems crazy to take a shower and then work out, but he can't have stink fumes coming from him like that. That's just wrong, y'all. It's just wrong. So we are going to get him in the shower. This this spot I'm really excited about. Now, I made a few modifications, but this is the Lux Health Club, as you can see. So it's one of the pre-made um, spa gym places that came with fitness stuff. In spa day, I think spa day, spa day, I think. Um, so it's one of the pre-made places. And for once, I did not do any recoloring. It's the original coloring. And what I want him to do, yeah, like I, so the only, the only changes I made was putting in this custom content um, exercise equipment down here. That was it. That was pretty much all I did. But I know there are showers here. So, but I'm going to have you come up and grab a shower. So there are saunas here and everything. And so I'm going to have him shower. Let me see which one. Which one is the right one? It's this one. Okay. So we're going to come up, take a shower, and then you're going to come down, back downstairs and do some workout. Maybe I'll help him feel a little bit better because he's feeling awful. And meanwhile, while he's in the shower, let's check out. Oh, Devin, what are you doing here? I mean, not Devin, Taylor. What are you doing here, sis? You don't even live in this city anymore. You're supposed to be in San Sequoia, not here, taking yoga classes. <laughs> I was going to say, let's check out what else is going on here. But there's a yoga class happening in there. Um, and then downstairs, oh, somebody's using the chin-up machines. That's cool. We got, oh, we got our girl here using the, the chin-up machine or the pull-up machine. Not your sister, too. You know, they kill me. And they're like, we can't, we can't, we can't leave our home. Y'all are in two different states two new cities and y'all want to come back here and get on the workout equipment okay i think he's done let's um he's done with the shower what do you want to do first do oh punching bag you can work out on there or actually you know what let's try to get on this this um let's try to do the uh the pull-up machine beginner no, we're not a beginner. What is our fitness level anyway? Fitness is eight. Oh yeah, we're not a beginner. Yeah, let's um let's come down here. Let's get on the the pull up bars for a minute. Maybe you know that'll help you feel better as far as your anger is concerned because you're a little upset. So let's do a workout and. And work some of that. Why are you not in your athletic wear? I don't understand. Let me help you out. Because I need you to be in athletic clothing. You're working out. There we go. That's much better. Dream's gone to work. You're going to work hard, Dream. So you can see now it's just the four of them. Oh my gosh. It's just his two parents, him and Grant. So he's definitely, definitely about to... um to grind and grind until he can get his make his way out of the house look at him doing these i mean effortlessly effortlessly he's doing this this is wild <laughs> he just without any like i mean dang my girl over here is struggling you a gym trainer and you struggling like this you don't need to be nobody's gym trainer Look at her. 
and and our guy over here is just knocking it out the park like it's nothing <laughs> that's crazy to me we need him to work out for an hour at least because i want he has one out of ten but i want him to get to two out of ten okay how about enraged epic rips okay do some enraged rips because maybe that'll make your your anger go down we at least want to get you to two my guy two out of ten hours because ten hours is a long time oh you know what else i meant to do girl don't come over here with us talking talking trash you couldn't even hold your own over here on the chin up bar i wanted to get him the gym rat aspiration i mean the gym gym rat reward since he loves the gym so much so let's go ahead on and get him that i think that would make the most sense so with that reward trait what he can do is he can build fun and he doesn't lose hygiene while exercising so that's cool a yoga class is starting in 30 minutes maybe we'll do a yoga class at cool down don't talk to us Devin. you're not even supposed to be here i'm still mad at you for that you're supposed to be in in del sol valley working on your acting stuff not here with us who is this girl her name is uh raiko raiko wantanabe and she's an adult and she called herself gym training us girl when you was over here struggling with them with them pull-ups earlier have we done two okay cool we're at two out of ten not us got a sentiment with her impressed raiko sure knows what she's doing and kobe has nothing but respect <laughs> okay kobe i'm just gonna chalk that up to you being young and naive as a teenager maybe you didn't see her over there struggling with the um with the pull-ups but she was struggling she was very much struggling what's his move list exercising with insight because he's being mentored kobe is getting more out of his reps with all the tips he's getting and bracing breezes the fresh air really makes this a great place to work out and he loves fitness because of course he does He's all about it. He is all about it. Are you done training us now? Can we work out in peace? Devin, leave us alone. Leave us alone, Devin. Go home. We're trying to get our workout on. Now, all of his moodlets, all of his negative moodlets are gone. I want to point out. Y'all remember he was enraged. He was upset. Look at that. A good workout. And he's worked out all of that energy. All of it is gone. This is his third hour. Devin. Get out of here, girl. Can we send her home? Go away. We trying to do something. Leave us alone. We over here minding our business. We got to get our workout on. Oops. That was a little too close. What are you doing now? Don't listen to music, okay? Just, yeah. Okay, well, he glitched out on that one. That's okay. Um, Let's have him come over here and, and punch the, the punching bags. I want him to work out until he gets the push the limits vibe. Okay, look at that bounce. Okay. Don't get rocky on us. Come on. Oh, oh look at her. She sure is following us around. Like, can you leave us alone and give us some space? <laughs> Look at him. Come on, Rocky. <laughs> what I'm talking about. Get your workout on. Get your workout on. He has a single and loving it lifestyle. That's great for you, dear. I want you to get this these workout going, though. Okay, we got four hours in. I at least want to get halfway there. Then I'll probably do the other half off camera to spare y'all. <laughs> Just <laughs> constant videos of him in the gym. <laughs> sure y'all not interested in seeing that. But we'll get him up to at least five out of the ten hours. I'll finish the other five off camera. And the next time we see him, he'll be um, ready to move out. And we can continue. We're going to get him some kids, though. He has to have some kids. He can't just move out. Well, he can move out. Yeah, he'll move out. We'll probably... Uh, I'll probably play with him. Give him, like, a little... 
mini family or whatever oh he's gonna go give him something to eat and then um and then we'll go back to dream because dream needs to to have um three more grandkids so she can meet that final goal so yeah we're definitely gonna give him some science babies y'all just as an homage i'm not sh sure if i'm gonna go you know with the same people but you know we can say that it is but we're definitely get, getting some science babies for him because we know that that's where his his path is going to take him so we'll do that and then we'll go and then the, and then the probably do that like the first half of the episode so when you see him next we're going to be aging him up moving him out getting his babies and then coming back to the house with dream where we'll decide what the next aspiration is that she's going to complete I'm excited because we've been in this aspiration for this is like 14 this part makes 14 parts that we've done with this aspiration which is wild it's wild all right dear let's come and well first you have to use the bathroom oh yeah swimming it's so much here I forgot about that swim some laps once you use the use the toilet you're gonna come down and swim some laps and let's see who got who okay who is miss thing down here trying to mentor that now devin devin is in the class D my dude my dude you stink yeah yeah you stink you need to go get in the shower you smell like ass go get in the shower you're trifling look at you you're filthy you need to get in the shower bruh Look at Devin. <laughs> Makes me sick. Just kill the immersion, you and your sister. Yeah, go get in the shower. I'm glad you're thinking about it. Then we got the alien here. Got an alien and then, okay, same instructor. Okay. I just wanted to peek around and see what was going on. This is actually a pretty cool little gym right here. I like this. And we got a sauna in here as well. Okay. My guy, I told you to swim. Why are you in here talking to the werewolf guy? Can you find the pool and do some energized laps like I told you to, please? And thank you. Let me get back on his little... <laughs> Zoom back in on your face here. Thank you. You looking real, real good. Much better than when you first um when you got home from school so that's a good thing and on that note y'all i am going to end the episode right here if you enjoyed the content you saw in today's video please leave a like comment and subscribe and i will see you next time bye